you have in the output process. And also in some of the uh, programming language, you, can't, you can only use the code of the program in order, in order to build a further integration. Um, in the evaluation concerning composer usability, uh, we evaluate our approach with, four, with 40 composers divided into two groups, 20 novices and 20 expert composers. Composers are requested to perform two tasks, tutorial and feed style tasks. And we took four sets of questionnaire. Um, the S set we observe of uh, composer background, C set about expectation, R set about expressibility, and P set about the preference. So we are going to report um, the result regarding expectation exp and expressibility before we observe the other results where we have. Uh, for pre and post questionnaire of C set, which observe composer expectation, um, the, the novice expectation, expectation decreased from 4.06 to 3.76. Um, so they think that the, they understand the concept in the abstract level, but they may not be familiar with um, the, con the configuration of parameters. And expert um, the expert composer's expectation is increased from 3.49 to 3.74. Um, and they believe that um, they, can, they are able to create matchup with mobile application components uh, effectively than what they did um, from the past. So in our set that observed the composer expressibility, uh, the expressibility score of two groups increased, um, you can see in the graph. And note that um, the novice, novice composers are able to create mobile mashups, and expert composers understand how to apply model with their work. So they may apply um, the factory web service um, composition method with the HTML and JavaScript, and they can um, create. Um, more of the mashup applications that more uh, more set of mashup application that they can do um, normally. Um, these are all the results that we found. Um, Novice prefer web application components than web service because um, we have um, developed the expect tools that help composers to use the web and the both resources. The full formalism helps composers understand the matchup composition. Um, however, the real-time simulation, so because in my model the generation process and the execution process is um, divided, so the real-time simulation is preferred. And also the GUI elements should be editable in some way. The last thing is, composers believe that MIDO can deliver 77% ready for what they are able to create with MIDO. Um, next, about the composition patterns. Most of the composers use IQO, um, input query output, one component at a time. And IQQO are, com are our common patterns. We found two patterns, common use. For mostly used components, we found that um, the GPS sensor is generally used as input and query are performed with uh, web application and web services. The output that commonly found is a list, a map, or a web-related output, such as HTML document or web service, web service uh, message. So about composition time, um, almost no difference found between two groups. The composers use around six to seven minutes to configure a single component. So uh, we can conclude that uh, a mashup with IQO or IQQO patterns may be completed within 20 to 26 minutes. Um, about the performance measurement, we compare the measurement execution to apply and not apply the measure process scheduling mechanism. Um, <coughs> the mashup that have um, two active components and other passive components work in backup. 
here you can see if you have active component connected to web services. So if you run this in um, 3G connection environment, you can you may reduce in average uh, reduce the um, execution time by 15 seconds. So in case A, uh, if you connect mobile application to active web web component uh, web application component, the in 3G connectivity. Uh, the connection time will reduce to um, will, will be reduced about uh, four seconds. So this is generally the average of um, if we use just a set of uh, web service not that is not um, we use only one um, the set we use only one web service to test at the time. So the web service here uh, the web application here. The time manager is controlled. So here we give the discussion about other related topics. Um, about the expressibility boundaries, uh, MIDO is a description language for mobile mashups. Therefore, new algorithms cannot be developed. And some of the restricted web resources are the reuses of web-enabled resources such as um, news, um, news website may confront some lack of issue and the other thing is that not all mobile applications are integrable. You have to know the how to use the execution parameters in Intent and and so is um, messaging pattern in Android. And about the implementation issue for a platform without cross, cross application communications um, um, like Docomo and I, I have believe, or Apple iOS. The components have to be prepared in coding level, and and also some cross domain security issue may occur because it connects to many web resources. So in this diagram, Mido can create um, cannot create new components, and also um, they cannot control the mashup execution in asynchronous timing. So when um, a device requests to execute some mashup, so everything has to run in sequence, so you cannot stop the sequence, do something, and get back to your um, execution. So we would like to, it would be better if we provide um, the execution in a, syn in a synchronous um, time manager. Um, the last section, the conclusion. So uh, we propose a description-based mobile measure development using MIDO. So the input you can use mobile application, web application, web service, arithmetic components. The output can be configured as a mobile application for the measure that used on single device. And for a measure for multiple devices, you can configure it, the output as tied to a web service and tied to a web application. The flow-based composition method is comprehensible so you, um, to novices, so the novice composers can understand the flow-based. Uh, composition methods about the event base, they allow more real-time interactive and customizable uh, composition to be integrated. The third array web service allow the cross-platform collaborative measure. And the third array web application, they enable functional the exchange. And you can also do the remote access to the measure on the device. Um, the automated mechanisms can deliver better performance in measure executions. And our method can be exposed to composers with our programming skills. And also it delivers more reusability than other approaches. So for our uh, future work, we involve the problem that um, the event-based composition contains many uh, programming elements such as HTML or JavaScript. And are not suitable for um, novice composers. So we would like to propose a description approach for event based mesh composition. The other thing is that um, when the mashup uh, into remote mashup is accessed, uh, the tethered mashup applications have to <coughs> execute and respond in real time so you cannot stop the flow of the uh, mashup and do something and you get back. So we'd like to propose a synchronous execution approach for collaborative mashup composition. Uh, last slide, this is my publication list, and thank you for your attention. Hi,